One of the great things about working with us here at Litson RV is our ability to communicate with you, our guests, through our vast resources of technology and our ability to put our recreational vehicles through the same paces that you would in the real world. So today we are in the 2021 Winnebago Revel, our Class B camper van on the 4x4 VS30 Mercedes-Benz chassis, which is now equipped with 3,200 watt hours of Lithionics Xantrex Smart Lithium Ion batteries. Those batteries will then feed a 2000 watt pure sine wave inverter, which provides complete whole coach 30 amp operation, including the rooftop air conditioner. So today we've arrived at our destination. Our batteries are fully charged. We actually have our Coleman Mach 10 NDQ non-ducted quiet air conditioner set and ready to actually use the Winnebago Rebel. Today in Forest City, it's gonna be a pretty good hot and humid day. Uh, it's going to be about 87 degrees with a heat index of about 96 degrees. It is 9.15 on Friday morning. We have our batteries fully charged. Our compressor driven refrigerator is at temp. We have a wide variety of LED lights on and we're going to see how long the Winnebago Revel will run and keep this coach nice and cool off of those 3200 watt hours of lithium batteries. So the batteries are mounted in the rear as you'll see from our walk around videos. I'm gonna move our way forward and just showcase the voltage in the batteries. So on your Xantrex panel, it'll show the batteries have 13.3 volts. That's also what the Zamp solar charge controller is showing. And then the battery level readouts from Winnebago in the one place panel are showing 13.3 volts. We have the 2000 watt pure sine wave inverter on. We typically set our air conditioner temps about 20 degrees back of the outdoor. So we actually have the Coleman Mach 10 NDQ uh, set at 77 degrees on automatic mode. So again, it's 9.15 on Friday morning. Let's put this through the paces and see how long we can stay cool in the 2021 Winnebago Rebel. Okay, so we're back. It's actually about 75 minutes later. It's 10.30 right now. Uh, inside the Revel, uh, we still have the thermostat set 20 degrees back of the outdoor temp um, right now. And you can actually hear it running now. It just kicked in uh, once again. It's 89 degrees outside here in Forest City. So let's check our voltage 75 minutes later. Again, we've had some lights. Um, the compressor fridge is running off of the 12 volt system. Uh, the air conditioning now is running. Let's check our voltage. Um, so if I come over to the Zamp panel, it's showing about 13. If I come over to the Xantrex panel, it's showing 12.6. And if I come over to the one place panel, it's showing 12.8. So all similar readings, um, just under 13. And so again, it's 75 minutes in and we'll check back uh, again shortly as we put the 2021 Rebel to the test in terms of how long we can run that air conditioner off of the 3200 watts of Xantrex Smart Lithium batteries. Okay, so we're back and we are exactly two hours into this test on the 2021 Winnebago Rebel. It's 11.15 a.m. here in Forest City. The temperature has risen quite sharply outside to 91 degrees. We're gonna check our voltages, but we're also gonna check out a new tool for you. So as we go to the one place panel, uh, if we go over to the Xantrex panel, you'll see that the battery voltage is at 13.3 amps, which is exactly what the Zamp solar charge controller is reading for the voltage of the batteries. Sliding over to the one place panel, we're also at 13.3 amps, excuse me, volts. So as we slide over now, we're gonna showcase a new tool that is available to Revel owners. This is the Xantrex Smart App. And you don't have to do anything except open the app. It will discover each of the individual batteries uh, within each of the Lithionics uh, 3200 watts total. Um, battery bank. We're going to go to the first one. A great tool to this is this is going to show you the state of charge. So this individual battery is at 83%. You can actually hear the Coleman Mach 10 NDQ just kicked on. Um, so 83% state of charge. Uh, the voltage is at 13 volts. Uh, current at 53 amps. You can see the power rating. The battery is at 83 degrees. Now that's internal. And then also the BMS temp is at 93 degrees Fahrenheit. So all good readings coming out of the shunt of the Xantrex Smart Lithium batteries. 
we'll circle back over it'll discover the second battery uh, which is also at 83 percent so a great tool for Revel owners and again we're two hours in and we'll stop back shortly as we put the Revel to the test okay so we're back it is exactly three hours after we started putting the 2021 Revel to the test with the smart lithium batteries powering the Coleman Mach 10 NDQ our refrigerator is still at temp it is a very comfortable 75 degrees here inside the Revel outside here in Forest City today it is now 91 degrees with 73 percent humidity so let's find out where our battery readouts are at so we'll come over to our one place panel uh, within the Xantrex inverter we're showing 13.1 of volts solar charge controller is showing 13.2 and the one place panel is showing 13.1 but most importantly let's slide back over to our smartphone app so this is the Xantrex smart lithium ion app which is bluetooth into each of the batteries uh, we'll check out the first one which is now showing a state of charge and i'm guessing it's going to be just under 70 69 percent uh 13.2 voltage just like the one place panel says uh, we'll slide over now to the second battery and they do self-discover it's very easy to connect again at 69 percent so again, three hours in, we have 69% uh, state of charge on each of those 125 amp batteries. Uh, it's 75 degrees right here inside the Rebel and outside it's 91 degrees. So stay tuned and we'll check right back. Okay, so welcome back. We are literally in our fourth hour of putting the 2021 Rebel to the test, powering full 30 amp coach operation directly off of those dual Xantrax lithium ion smart batteries. So it is 115 right now here in Forest City. It's 92 degrees outside. Uh, relative humidity is between 69 and 70% for a very sticky day. So let's check our voltage levels and then let's also go ahead and check out the state of charge. So looking over at the Xantrex controller, uh, we are at 13 volts. Uh, we are at 13 volts on the Xamp solar charge controller and uh, 13 volts on the house batteries. So again, swinging over to the Xantrex Smart Lithium Battery app, you'll see each of the individual batteries. Uh, the first one is at 57% state of charge, and then the second one will pair up. And that one is at 57%. So again, good readouts. You can hear the air cycling on and off with that Coleman Mach 10 NDQ. Uh, it's 75 degrees, very comfortable here inside the rubble right now. Again, this is the fourth hour at 115, and we'll continue on as we put the 2021 Revel to the test. All right, so welcome back. It is actually the fifth hour. It's 215 Central Time here in Four City. Uh, it is still 92 degrees outside with 70% relative humidity, so kind of a scorcher out there today. It's cool and comfortable inside the Revel at 75 degrees. And so let's check our voltage and also check our state of charge. So sliding over, uh, you can actually see on the Xantrex panel, uh, we're down to 13.1 volts. 13.1 uh, volts on the Xamp solar charge controller. And on Winnebago's one place panel, we're at 13.1 volts, but most importantly, uh, we're going to swing over to our Xantrex Bluetooth app and you can see each of the batteries uh, that are paired up. We'll go to our first one and we started out at 100%. We're now down to 42%. So again in our fifth hour and then we'll discover again and we'll go to the other battery which is at 42%. So 42% state of charge uh, into our fifth hour. Uh, again, 92 degrees outside and 75 degrees here inside the Rebel. Okay, well, welcome back. It is actually 3 o'clock here in Forest City. So we are six hours into putting the 2021 Rebel to the test. It's 94 degrees outside in Forest City right now with 67% relative humidity. And so let's check our voltage readings and then also check out the state of charge within the Xantrex app. So if we come over to Winnebago's one place panel, you'll see on the Xantrex panel itself, we're showing 12.1 on the solar charge controller, 12.4. Coming over to the one place panel, we're at 12.4 volts. But most importantly, let's swing over to the Xantrex app. We have each of the batteries paired up via Bluetooth. 
to our Xantrex app, we'll check out the first battery. And it has dropped, I'm guessing, quite a bit. We are down to 18% state of charge on the first battery. And as we come over and check out the second battery, again, we are at 18%. So really keeping up well. I mean, we are six hours into this on one of the warmest days that we've experienced here in Forest City. It's 75 degrees here inside the Revel with the Coleman Mach 10 NDQ cycling on and off on automatic mode as we put the 2021 Revel to the test, powering 30 amp whole coach operation directly off of that 2000 watt pure sine wave inverter, including running the air conditioning, our refrigerator's main temp, and we'll come back again in about an hour. Hi everyone, Jason here at Litson RV in Forest City, Iowa. We're continuing with our uh, test in the 2021 Revel with the lithium uh, package and running the AC today. Um, it is about four o'clock central time, 90 degrees outside with the humidity level of approximately 60%. So a very hot uh, and muggy day here in Forest City. Um, last time we checked in, our battery levels were sitting around 16, 17%. And somewhere between that time frame and coming back in now at four o'clock, we did lose power uh, to the system. So we were able to successfully run the AC in auto mode, so cycling off and on at 75 degrees for six hours. So um, that's our test for today. And we're just gonna take a peek at the solar. Uh, as you can see, it's still charging, 13.1. Uh, and you look over at the house batteries here, that is also still showing the 13.1 as well. And then lastly, we'll take a peek at, obviously the, the app here through the Bluetooth. You can see the battery level is at 1%. We go back and look at the second battery. That is also at 1%. So again, we were successfully able to do the six hours on the AC today. And um, we appreciate you taking the time to view the video and we will certainly produce more videos, measurements, everything with the new 2021 Revel.